Hi, right, we're 24 hours away from the South Coast Beach Body Show and we're delighted to have Chris in from over in the UK for uh, PhD. Uh, PhD are very kindly sponsoring uh, a lot of the event for us this weekend. Um, Chris is actually competing um, as well as you know doing the PhD stand and, and, and doing some PR on behalf of PhD. So we're delighted to have you back, mate. Yeah, really to be here. Long time no see. Yeah. Um, in terms of uh, your listening, how are you feeling? Uh, I'm feeling okay. Um, had a, a few uh, magazine kind of castings this week, last week, so I had to cut pretty hard. It was kind of a right. walking phase. Okay. Um, so I cut pretty hard, so probably a bit weaker than it would be, but we'll see. Yeah. A bit lighter as well. So. Uh, oh, power to weight ratio. Um, since I've seen you over the last kind of 18 months, you've had a, a meteoric rise to fame, so to speak, in PhD. Can you want to tell us a bit about that? Yeah, it's been mad. Um, I suppose I've been, it's been a kind of a year, year and a half now. Mm. Um, so um, basically it, it was actually Roger that uh, put me in touch with PhD first day, um, just I suppose to try and uh, build the PhD brand over here in Ireland. Um, but yeah, it's been amazing, it's been incredible. Um, yeah. What about, what, so, what about your new role? What's that all about? Yeah, so um, they've recently taken me on a, uh, a, a, a full-time role as um, their uh, PhD science expert. So I suppose really what that is, is from being an athlete, or a brand ambassador where mm -hmm. you're endorsing the brand um, from a visual point of view. Um, I suppose I'll be doing a lot more um, kind of scientific content, blog writing, um, videos, that kind of thing, educational stuff, yeah. um, which is brilliant because as you know, anything that um, from my cancer research background that can yeah. tie in my passion as a scientist um, and my ability to you know, yeah. do anything fitness related is brilliant. Yeah. I don't I don't think many people are aware of the, the actual, not PhD, the brand, but the actual PhD that you're doing. What, yeah. what is that? Uh, well, so I'm doing um, a PhD in cancer research. Um, so in mm -hmm. particular in, in, in leukemia. Right. Um, so yeah, that's basically the main reason why I went over to the UK. Right. And um, you're based in London, are you? Yes. Yeah, sorry, London. So I've got a year left. Oh, um, okay. And then who knows? Dr. Spearman. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. Because I, I don't think many people make that association with you as an athlete, but also you as the scientist. Yeah, you know what I find it's um, it's a privilege to be to suppose I kind of have almost like two worlds in a sense, um, mm. and it's really good to be able to switch off from one to the other. Yeah. And um, rather than it being a hindrance, it actually helps me in lots of ways. I think yeah. doing a PhD, you're you're researching something that no one in the world has ever researched before. It's that niche and. It can be really lonely, really. It can really consume you as a person, mm. um, mentally as well. It's it, it can be really really difficult. So, to be able to um, have a break and get away from that is incredible. Like, and I suppose that's really what the gym is for me. Brilliant, brilliant. In terms of the South Coast Beach Body Show, you're uh, three times defending champion of the deadlift. Yes. Who are you gonna have got bench this year? I might do. I might do. It's under wraps, so there's a bit of uh, there's a bit of tension going on between uh, <laughs> a few guys. So uh, we'll see how I feel tomorrow. Cool. Okay. Well, we hope that comes off because I'd I'd like to see you bench. Um, you, you in terms of power to weight ratio, you're an incredible athlete. So it's it's a delight to have you over. It's brilliant to be here. Um, what are you, what are you expecting in terms of the show generally? You you're going to judge for us on the yes. the beach body. Yeah, can't wait. So last year was uh, the first year that the, the Strongman's had this kind of beach body bikini kind of competition and yeah. um, for those of you who weren't there last year, you missed out big time. Um, I, I remember last last year I was uh, in Belfast for the Irish Muscle Power um, and I was down here on the Saturday and you know they're both really good competitions and stuff but this competition is just going from strength to strength. I mean I remember yeah. four or five years ago when there was two guys benching downstairs yeah, with, with <laughs> a bench press. And it's now, mm. I mean, it's there's hundreds of people going to be there. Mm. Um, I think it makes a huge difference as well to have something that you've got a bikini or a beach body competition in this part of Ireland as well, because not a lot of people um, are confident enough to get on a bodybuilding stage. Yeah. And this is a really, really good transition for bikini girls or, or guys who want to make that transition to that stage. It's a really good kind of, and there's good atmospheres, good buzz, mm. there's people lifting. I remember there was a guy last year who, did the beach body and he was like right i'll give the deadlift a go and he did really well yeah. so um it's good and i like the fact that the lifts are done on on like i suppose power to weight ratio because 
you've got some guys lifting deadlifting 300 kilos but they're weighing 120 kilos yeah. so you, you, you've i know a guy in particular who's going to be coming down he's about 71 72 kilos and he's going to be deadlifting relatively heavy but it means he's still in the mix so yeah, yeah it's really really good yeah. really really good hats off to you really because you know i mean roger and everyone here has put in a huge amount of time and effort over the last few years to really mm -hmm. make it a good show and yeah it's one to watch well we'll look forward to seeing you lift tomorrow yeah brilliant. very best of luck brilliant. the competition's going to be tough so if you're in the south coast area tomorrow and you're looking for something to do between 12 and 7 the south coast beach body show will more than welcome you and we'll have some serious entertainment for you so we'll see you tomorrow